Hey there guys, the Remos Online here, bringing you Battle 2 against Duncan Lee Deep, also known as Derp Knight. Uh, if you guys didn't see the last video, go check it out. Links to Derp Knight, Derp Knight's YouTube in the doobly-doo, go check him out. So with that out of the way, I'm still bringing my uh, Premier Challenge team and Duncan's still bringing his German Nats team. So at this point, I now know his Heatran is the wrong Heatran, is the uh, max speed timid one. And he also, and he knows that I'm a Trick Room team, or at least thinks I'm a Trick Room team. So I bring my Tailwind this battle to try and surprise him there, and I am able to get the surprise. Wasn't expecting the Tailwind. He was expecting like the Scarf final gambit, I think. So I get off my Tailwind, and I go for the knockoff of the Heat, trying removing its um, Scarf. He did go for the Icy Wind with the Kaferi, which is kind of a surprising move. I think he already told he told me that it had Icy Wind back at the VGPC, so I knew it had Icy Wind. I didn't think he'd go for it though, because that's now boosting my Manamar speed. Uh, and it is actually going to matter because Manamai is faster than you think and I do run some speed investment. So I actually outspeed my own jolly max speed Star Raptor and get off my final gambit, which coupled with a superpower is going to be enough to take out the Landorus. So Heatran's main threat is already dead. Turn 2. He goes for the Moonblast onto my Manamai. That does a lot of damage considering that this Kaferi has no investments, like 4 investment in special attack. So he brings in his Metagross, I bring in my Heatran. Heatran's safe with that Air Balloon, which I somehow forget about and misplay, but we'll get there in a minute. Uh, he goes straight for Mega Evolution, so he's obviously staying in. Probably going to go for the Protect. So I wanted to try and get the KO on the Kaferi with a knockoff Flash Cannon. Um, because of the speed boost, I'm now going to be faster than my own Heatran. So I can go for the knockoff on Kaferi and then Flash Cannon for the KO. He actually double Protects to stall out my Tailwind for an extra turn. So he's now forced with Joy Metagross, however, uh, that Kaferi just kind of sitting there, really looking like it wants to, uh, you know, do something, but it doesn't. I get, I go for the knockoff, and I don't go for the flat, I get the critical hit as well, the RNG is not being nice to him right now. Uh, it doesn't, doesn't get the flinch with the rock slide on either of my Pokemon, does, and gets the uh, critical hit, or I get the critical hit, critical hit, I should say. I go for the heat wave there, I, for some reason, didn't think he'd switch out the Metagross, I was dumb. But uh, I did get some massive damage on the Kaferi as a result. Tailwind tail ends, and I bring in my Gardevoir. Now, again, as I just mentioned, I forgot I had my Evolute, so I didn't have to fear the uh, the Earth power at all. But I still was dumb and still protect with my Heatran here, but I really didn't need to. I could have risked being doubled up. I mean, it wouldn't have killed, but I could easily have risked being doubled up into in there. He goes to the Icy Wind, would have popped my Air Balloon had I not protected, but as I mentioned, he's the Timid variant, I'm modest, so he's going to be slower than me in a Trick Room, and I am able to safely set that up. Um, Kaferi goes for the Protector, now what he's trying to do is live an Earth Power from my Heatran, uh, because with the Friend Guard, it reduces damage taken by 25%, so there is a chance he'd live if he was a bulky Heatran, unfortunately, as I mentioned, like a bajillion times now. He is a max speed timid one, so it's not it's unfortunately not gonna live that. And at this point it is the game. Um the, the this icy wind, uh Petunia actually avoids it. The previous icy wind when I went for my trick room means my Gardevoir is going to outspeed my Heatran inside this trick room. So I'm able to get off a hyper voice here, and uh that may that now means that my heat wave is gonna be single target and is not gonna be reduced by friend guard. So that it basically isn't the case. I could have gone for the Earth Power, I guess. I wasn't thinking very well, but yeah. Pretty sweet game two of Duncan. We actually ended up having a third game because why not? It's not an official tournament. We can do what we want. So that video will be going up tomorrow. Stay tuned for that. Uh, and I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. I really don't know how to end videos.